Hello, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to Cities Skylines. Yes, uh, I know this game has been a little bit late. Uh, it launched Tuesday, and I only released the video today. Uh, I do apologize for that, and calm your tits. I've got the game, and we are going to do this. Um, yesterday, in my H1Z1 video, I did talk about these are the type of games I like to play. And just the other day, long before I knew this game was coming out, um, what happened is... I told myself, and I do speak to myself a lot, that we are in dire need of a game like City Skylines. So, without further ado, let us jump straight in. This is the main menu. We've got your Steam Workshop here, which is really cool. Um, if you get stuck with something or just want some stuff to improve, uh, there, it's mods, mods enabled, so you can get different mods and stuff. <laughs> and... Yeah, it, just, it supports mods, which is really cool. So, if you want to get like a nice intersection for your city, then you can get it here. Different buildings, if you want. I think it's mostly cosmetic looks anyway. Um, but I like the automobiles and pedestri pedestrians intersection. That Those kinds of things I do not think is cosmetic but it will help you in your city so anyways let us continue on to a new game you guys can play around uh there is one thing tools you have a met, uh, map map editor and an asset editor um map editor obviously self-explaining and asset editor you can i think you basically create like the intersections and stuff of this and it saves into your game okay so let us continue new game Ooh. okay now this is apparently better than uh, SimCity 5, was it? Yeah, where SimCity 5, you only had a few certain, like a certain area to build in, where this game is a bit different, and I'll show you guys in a moment. Um, having just played this game, this is the first time I'm running it, and I'm playing with you guys. If you guys have any comments on what I'm doing wrong, or any tips or tricks or tactics, give me a message in the comments. Just leave it there, and I will get back to you, or I will implement it in the next episode. So, let's see here. River Run, Green Plains, uh, what else is there? We need something with a bit of water because we do need that. Um, I really don't know. I really don't know. Sandy Beach, seems nice. I almost talked to my native language. Shady Strands, this islands, near Blackwood seems actually nice. River Run. Blackwoods seems like it has a bit more water, so Blackwoods. Okay, and what do we need for a name? Um, how about Monkey Topia? Monkey Topia, which is which I think it's a great name. Um, it might have been taken. I don't know. Let's start and see where we can go from here. Now we are here. Hello. Yes. Hi. Uh, kind of did watch how the game does look on. Let's just zoom in. Man, that new, that noise is too much. Let me just turn that down. It's quite high, actually. Uh, just did this. Most of these things, maybe half of it. There we goes. Oh, that sounds better. Way better. Okay, so this is the game. Um, to rotate your camera like this, I just discovered, is middle mouse button and just, you know, <coughs> doing this. Sorry, just had something in my throat. And it looks like we've got a nice little island here. And scroll in, zoom in is scrolling your mouse button. Um, looks like we've got a nice little place here. Whoopsie daisy. Just went out of the border. <laughs> um, yes, I'm running this in windowed mode so I can get better frames and whatnot. Um, this game doesn't look like it is insane with the frames. Insane in the mainframe. Uh, okay, so basically why the, the roads are split here. One is in, one is out. Basically, one on the right hand side over here, that is a out. This one over here. This one's out. This one's in. No, this one's in. This one goes out. This one goes into you. I'm just rambling on. I'm so excited about this game. Man, I love games like this. Okay. Now, how do we want to play our plan our city i'm just gonna do a small little thing oh yeah and this is one why this game is better than some city let me show you areas you have this one soon you can unlock nine minus the one because this is the one you are playing in 
and then nine others around you. Doesn't matter which direction you go, it all depends on you. But nine blocks, I mean, come on, that is really, really cool. Uh, let me zoom in. Oh, yeah, just have to click there. All right, let's go. And depends on how big this game is after recording. Um, that will, I just got a notification, that will help us a little bit. Um, if I can, if the file is small, then definitely we will head straight into 15 to 20 minutes, maybe even 30 minutes of gameplay. But I'm just rambling on, let's just continue with the building. Okay, so we've got different things. Uh, tools, which are here. I know that is the upgrade. Those are free form, curvy road, and straight road. I know the straight road snaps easily. And the different mods enable different things, which we do not have here. We just have these smaller roads. We click on that one, click and drag. As you can see, it gives us a little bit of uh, the zoning areas in the blue squares, I know. Um, how about we just go ahead just a little bit. Don't we have a dirt road? I swear there should have been a dirt road. Anyways. Um, okay. And then, yeah, from there on you can turn any way you want. And let's do it with the same with this one. Okay, and then we are going to branch out from there. So what I'm like mainly to do is um, on very far away, I would do my industrial areas and stuff for the pollution to be away from my people and just to separate the industrial from the commercial. Because I know from the from some city that I knew there is some issues there. And I'm going to try to avoid building here because I know in any game, the traffic is a bitch to work with. So, okay. Um, let's go from here. Out. How many is that? It's one, two, three, four, five blocks. And let's do that. Okay. And from here. That's one, two, three, four, five blocks. And then just connect it. Yeah, I know grids are boring, but th that's the way I like it. All right. Um, trying to right mouse button. Okay, we don't have much cash on us, so we need to be careful of what we are building. All right, just go a little bit like this. There we goes. This will look like our residential area. No, nope, one more. A little bit more just to occupy the space better. And the best thing is about this game, you don't have to worry too much about the space. Um, because you can further enlarge it later. So I was thinking maybe around like this part, this outside ring for some commercial. Inside will be residential. Shut the hell up! Damn it. I hate it when my phone just randomly freaking... What is it? Ah, just a freaking message. Anyways, days are passing. We need to start zoning. So this is your zoning button. Um, you got different tools here as well. One is like full. So we want to fill in a whole block. I think we are going to do that. Um, how about we just uh, pause the game. We can uh, fill in the blocks over here. Um, and uh, the way I'm moving my camera is W, S, A, and D. And I think that is a really cool move, you know. Instead of using your right mouse button to scroll around and just use your mouse the whole time, I like using my keyboard as well. So let us go ahead and add some com uh, residential there and maybe low density commercial there. There. Um, just to show you guys the marquee tool, you just click and drag. But if, let's say, for instance, my camera is like this, it will stay with the camera. So, and if you want to work within the blocks, just click inside a block and start dragging. Okay, so that's one of those. And then you just get a small brush and then a large brush if you want specific areas to be, you know, what you call it, be filled in. Okay, now we definitely need power. Okay. Uh, windmills and coal. I think we're going with, uh, not windmills, wind turbines. Let's see where is the best. 
is actually kind of here in the middle of the city here and that circle you see that is noise pollution oh we don't know not getting oh yes 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 we want it over here so let's go ahead and build one two of them just for in case and then we'll supply it with power lines as soon as to get power over here power lines um, you don't have to like individually connect power I'm just gonna put it in here uh, just remember if you're playing um, each little thing has a power upkeep all the way okay now we need water and this is very important our water pumping station must be let me show you guys there is a, as you guys can see, there is a flow, and here is a flow. So you basically want your water sewerage, let's put one over here, to be dumping out <coughs> away from uh, clean water, okay? So that you don't accidentally suck up with the water pumping station some freaking uh, pollution. But we are going to pollute anyways. And since... I'm just gonna. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna plop him down here because this might be fine for now. Let me just turn this and see where we can add that. And we're not, not, not gonna break up anything. So, and yes, you can break up. Uh, screw you, screw you. Get away from me. Um, let's quickly check out the power, and they all are filled in. So that's great. Now power. I mean water. Underwater. Pipes, doesn't matter where you put them, they will always supply water. So basically what we want to do is, as we can see, there's a little node. Click on that one, and let's just drag it all the way to here. And I like to put them underneath my streets, so it's easier to know... No, not there. Easier to use... Actually, we can utilize this better. There we go, a little bit of overlapping going on there. And little overlapping going on there. Alright. So that and that and that is done. That is done. Let us continue with our city. Is there a shortcut key for accelerating time? I do not know. Let's get out of here. And see how our pedestrians are or people are coming in. Okay. Let's zoom in a little. Did I ever zone? I think I did. Yeah, I did. Okay. Um, yes, yes, I know there is more options in... Okay, look, there, we got life. We got life. And I think if you put it like the electricity close to one corner, they would start doing there. Like, start building there. Oh, yes, we've, we've got to... Pause, pause, pause. The pipelines also work for sewage as well. So, let's go ahead and connect up the sewage line pipe over here and connect it up oh yeah and this bad boy needs some power right well, this is gonna be a problem all we can do is we can probably run it from there zoom in here just click click and continue on to here and just run it up here just for now, we will change this. We will change this soon. Okay, and continue. And close this. Yes, yes, your sewage will be sorted out soon. There we go. And we will see lovely, lovely poop. Mm -mm -mm. Can you guys smell that? Oh, yes, it smells so good. Yes, I love the sewage in the morning. Okay, let's go back here and see how our people are doing. Okay, we still got some down here is our requirements or what people want. Apparently, we're not making any money. But we have people moving in. Um, can I get high speed again? Thank you. We're not making any money just yet, but people are moving in and that is slowly declining. So, uh, what is that? Different information. Overlays. Oh, yes. We have this little thingies over here. My finger bobs. Shows us our electricity. As you can see, connect the power lines and then it will sort itself out from there. Which is great. I think that's awesome. That's our water. Our water flow. 
it flows from one point to the other. We've got great graphs showing us what to do. Um, our citizens are, well, maybe happy um, plopping down some parks and stuff. That would be great. Um, we've got a new zone available. I don't know. Oh, yeah, we, we can still... Okay, now they want industrial. So let's go and make some industrial things. Somebody just messaged me. I do not care. You can go away and burn hell. I'm just joking. <laughs> um, yeah, yeah, yeah. I kind of know how the game works. Just see. Hmm, hmm. Why is it... Oh, yeah, it's on the wind and this is traffic. Our traffic is being used. Okay, so it's very low, which is great. Let's go ahead and pause the game. And let us start by making another road. Um, let's say from this side. Um, also about five. One, yeah, one, two, three, four, five. Is that far enough? And let's go a little bit further than that. Okay. Um, one, two, three, four, five. Yeah, that was a bit too long. Go up. Okay. And let's go with this one as well. There and there. And this one as well. See, we're gonna fill this in some other time, but I want here on the far end, I want some good, good old fashioned industrial. No, that's too short. No, no, go away. Do this. There he goes. And pull those is B. Yes, I'm glad I figured that out. Gonna need that a lot. Okay. Nope. One more. There he goes. How about we just do this? Okay. Great. Great, 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 great. Okay, we got the game paused. Um gonna keep this like this um there we goes there we goes and just a little bit more like that will that overlap yeah seems like it kind of okay well it doesn't matter as long as there's industry for the people full bucket i want to fill this in and like such and we don't want to do that whole part, so let's take, take, take our marquee. Uh, click and drag, sunshine. There we goes, like that, and like that. And we want to supply them with water, so, and electricity. But I think they are touching. Um, stop touching me. Let's go like this. Yes. And like this. Yes, it's great. Great, 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 great. Okay. Now we are going to zone in some industrial. Oh, yeah, we did already that stupid. And if you want to de zone something, there is a tool here which is de zone, or you can just right click and drag with the marquee tool and it will de zone for you. Okay, there we go. And let's close that and resume the game. Let's see, let's see. Huh, this is so nice. Look at look at this. It is so awesome. Oh man. And you can zoom in so much. I like it how the cars are parked on the sides. Just heard a dog. Where's the dog? Oh man, our little neighborhood. It is growing. The king is happy, so shall his people be. Great stuff. And let's check out here. Wow, these people are booming. As you can see already, power lines are connected to these industrials and so on. It spreads, which is great. And we reached the little hem hamlet, ladies and gentlemen, which is awesome. Nice, nice, nice. We get an elementary school, medic clinic, and a landfill site. We get taxes, loans, garbage, healthcare, and education, services, and features. Okay, which is great. Now we can go ahead with the landfill, uh, which we will definitely need. Let's see, these people are... Oh, wait a minute. Oh, wait a minute. I just thought of something. 
Let's go ahead and do that. Landfall. I just don't want to make too many intersections and whatnot, so I don't want to clog up the road too much. There we go. Um, if anybody can tell me the shortcut key to, like, speed up and speed down, that's that would be really, really awesome. That would be great advice. Okay, there we go. Now we just need a landfill site. Because people are going to want to throw away their garbage. And let's check out the coverage. We don't want it too close. Yeah, that's great. That's great. I like that. Alright. Now we need some hospitalization. So we'll add a clinic. Where shall we add a clinic? Um, around here somewhere? Hmm. Yeah. So it can cover this area as well. So let's go ahead and plop that down. Makes everybody happy. Um, anything else? Oh yeah, education. Yes, yes, go away. Education. Let's take an elementary school, which we'll probably just need around here. I think. Um, let's put it on the opposite side. Just want to see where's the entrance. Yeah, that will do. Okay. And they are complaining about workers. But you will get your workers very soon. Alright, and we kind of ran out of money there. But we've got the basics down. This is the basics. This is really, really great. Oh, man. I miss this type of game. Oh, man. So awesome. Love this game so much. Okay. Oh, man. My, <laughs> my throat is getting to get sore <clears throat> and I'm getting really thirsty really wish I did make something to drink see-through plastic jackets are in fashion right that sounds like the dream thing for any guy the dream fashion girls must wear that girls do that make some fashion see-through fashion that'd be great you're still wearing clothes it's just see-through I think that already exists somewhere in fashion if people are not wearing tires Okay, so main things that we should remember is not just education and all that stuff. Um, backlogs and whatnot for trucks and whatnot. If I quickly, can I quickly pause? Just want to see something. Oh, we made it to Worthy Village. So we got fire department, police department and some unique buildings. We get some new specializations in industry and agriculture. Power usage, water usage and smoke detectors. And we get a police station firehouse. All these beautiful things. And now we get a 2x2 two two kilometer um, zones, new areas we can choose to buy and utilize the way we want it. Um, let's see. Well, between these two, this side, that's going to have a lot of sewage going down there. Hmm. All right. That's great. Uh, we'll check in the future if we want anything. Oh, man. I wanted to... Can I click the bird? Can I click that bird? I heard you can click birds. Come on, birdie. Yes, there we go. Seagull. <laughs> great. And you can rename. And you can rename all your citizens and whatnot. Okay, so there's a little demand for... Just a little bit for more residential areas. So we're going to expand our residential up this way. Nice coastal... Almost co coastal. I'm gonna expand it up that way. Industrial is gonna be on this side. And then I think over here, our major city center is gonna be there. Like more heavy uh, curving and stuff on the roads. That's what I'm trying to say there. Man, just a major brain fart. <clears throat> okay. Why is everything snail pace? Hmm. Okay, so everything looks great. Look, everything looks like it's going swell. Wow, I'm loving this. Okay, so what I was thinking, maybe we should... And that's what I was talking about. One ways will help solve many, many problems. Okay, we're still zoned here. Is that the fastest? Yeah, that's the fastest this will go. Okay, one ways will help relieve some traffic problems we might encounter. 
Landfalls. Just, I don't want to go too fast. I want to still learn the game. Um, what is there? Let's look up the new stuff. Yeah, go away. Don't need you. Wait, these people need... Oh, yes, we need more electricity. There we go. Thank you for that fair warning. Let's go ahead and plop down some more electricity. Because if we go to our electricity, we see we are in the red. We need to make more electricity stuff. Let's go ahead. Plop that one down. Got a little bit of cash, so we just plop another one down as well. And soon we want these... Oh, go ahead. Go away. These advanced wind turbines. We're going to need those very, very soon. Um, just for safekeeping. Just going to put down another one. Alright. Let's check out our water usage. Water availability, still high. Sewage treatment, still high. So, that is awesome. That is really, really awesome. Um, there was one thing I wanted to check out. We've got specialized... I just have to go check out how to do that. But I know you get... Oh, wait. Was it here? Or was it here? Oh, here we go. Specialized district stuff. Um, but it doesn't show you. Um, where is it? Is it this? Yes, there we go. Our natural resources. Outside? No, that's... Yeah, natural resources. As we can see, we got a little bit of forestry here. And what is that? Fertile land, which can be used for... You know, um, farms and stuff, but unfortunately we already planted some of our uh, industrial area there. But as you can see here, there on the right hand side, ooh, that looks like a great, great field of oil we can use. And that's going to be a lot of money being brought in. Um, I don't see anything else. Just mostly forestry. There's some more oil over there, but I think we're going to aim for that oil over there. And this open water means more shipping, so we can use boats in the near future. All right. Let's get out of this and go back into the game. Wow. We are really, really doing this. This is great. Awesomeness. A bit more residential is being called for and... Commercial is still booming. People need a place to work. Like I work at commercial or go to the industrial area. And so far, no major traffic. I'm actually glad. Yes, we reached a tiny town. Hey, <laughs> We are really, really going up in life right now. And I hope I'm not going too fast in life. I mean, in this game, not in life. In life, I always go too fast. Okay. So things look brilliant over here. Um, let's go around town and check out the different things. Hmm. Nice houses. So, the mods, what it will enable you to do is change some of these buildings. Because you can see sometimes the buildings repeat themselves. Uh, good example here. They re these two repeat. Um, but I think the mods will definitely help you get more unique, different buildings. And, uh, yeah. Abandoned building. Oh, it burned down. Oh. Oh. We probably need a fire station. <laughs> Whoopsie daisy, forgot all about that. Um, would it be wise to put it here? Just zoom out. Let's see the coverage. Um, just want a little bit of coverage. Yeah, that might do. That might do. Can we put it there? No, it's already occupied. You know what? Right there. That will do. And it's calling for more industrial... No, residential. Hmm, new services and stuff. Alright, anyways, ladies and gentlemen, thank you for joining me on City Skyline. I will definitely make more episodes of this. Already having a ton of fun, but I think our time is up. And yeah, and I will see you guys next time. Cheers, eh?